Hi everybody, Beanmeister22 here. Hey, today we're going to do something a little different, but it's kind of more of an update for you. Now, if you remember, I made a video months ago saying, hey, I don't know what kind of spider this is. Identify this spider. And as always, my most knowledgeable viewers were able to answer my question. Okay, so this spider right here, this unknown spider that's been wandering around near my spider tanks, has been identified as a male black widow. If you remember, we keep the spiders and the scorpions in double containment. So they are in smaller tanks inside of a larger tank that has a sliding lid and that can latch. So if there happens to be an earthquake or something along those lines and this falls off of the table where it's at, this probably... Well, yes, it might break if it hits the floor, but if it doesn't break, the lids will come off the inner containers, obviously, but the outer container, your secondary containment, will remain secure due to the sliding latching lid. Now, yes, if the glass broke, all you'd have is a sliding latching lid secured and a bunch of spiders and scorpions running around. But we already have spiders running around the house, right? So what's a few more? So this is a male Black Widow, and he has been building webs and creeping around, like I said, in that secondary containment. And I hunt him down, I look for him, I can't find him, and then maybe a few days later or a week later, I'll take a look at the tanks, and he'll be wandering around in there. So he's got a good hiding place, and I don't know where it is. And the other spider we're going to look at is this spider, we call him the Cup Spider. If you remember, this is also from a video where I said, hey, I don't know what this spider is, identify it. And this has been identified as a male false widow. So in this video today, we looked at a male black widow and a male false widow. Now, if you see a male false widow, or a male black widow for that matter, you are not going to confuse it with a female false widow or a female black widow. In fact, as you can see here, if you look at this spider, you're not even going to think this is a black widow at all. Well, because it's very much different. The male of these species looks very different from the female and they are generally smaller. But even though they're generally smaller, they might appear to have a larger leg span because of the way they walk and move and crawl and spread out more. But if you, when the female black widow spread out, they're actually bigger. It's so not just in body, but also in leg span. All right, so I would like to thank several of my viewers who sent me those messages saying, hey, this is a male black widow. Hey, this is a male false widow. Thanks, and you guys know, we strive to keep things educational here. So, you got educated, you learned something today. All right, so leave your comments in the comment section. As always, thanks for watching. Beanmeister22, the most dangerous man on YouTube. <laughs>